but this is the first time I've done anything in person in over a year. My favorite thing about talking to someone is that just the quick reaction you can have. Right. And that the whole chemistry of that is totally off on Zoom. I agree. <laughs> That, that was my three second delay because that's usually how it is, right? And it's so uncomfortable. It is. It's even Thank goodness we're not doing that anymore. This week on the Oh My Golf podcast, the TikTok guy is in studio. Dave Jorgensen, the Washington Post TikTok star, brings much needed levity to hard news, drawing in some young readers, more than a million followers, in fact, on the platform. Well, we chatted about everything from evolving with social media and his new book filled with tips to help anybody make creative content on the most downloaded app in the U.S. <laughs> Make a TikTok every day. 365 prompts for attention grabbing TikToks. Each chapter starts with an interview with a creator about that chapter. The, the ideas are all mine. A lot of them were just rejected ideas that I couldn't use for a newspaper TikTok. So TikTok just took off for you. This was what, 2018 that you got on board with that? Late 2018, I'm like, there's an app and no one knew what I was talking about, which yeah. is wild to think about. But even uh -huh. 2019, most of my coworkers had never heard of TikTok. I remember one time getting, you know, I talked about Twitter on air and I got in trouble by my news director at the time uh, for pushing another website opposed to really? the station website. The difference between TikTok and Instagram and Facebook is that one post can change your life. All you need is one really viral TikTok, technically. The crazy viral ones that get uh, like 20 million views, that yeah. person picks up a million followers. It's crazy. Hey, uh, Carmela, do you, do you want to pay instead? Um, hey, Chris, do you want to get this one? I kind of go between the two worlds hey. of keeping it authentic, but also keeping it uh, you know, polished enough for a newspaper. All right, kids, we got some healthier meals for you. Ooh. Man. You got a problem? Take it up with Michelle Obama. What's her Snapchat? Hey, kids, the Trump administration reversed all those rules, so here's some milk with fat in it again. Yay. Fatty milk! Hey, kids, we're doing healthy food again. Why? A government study found that you were all way healthier for the years we had healthy food. This sucks. Wait, why am I still in high school? <laughs> what, what's the favorite TikTok you've done so far? Do you have one? <laughs> Remember the sea shanty thing on TikTok? Yeah. Yes. And I just, I, I just related to a story about Congress. It took about four hours, but it was the only time that I can remember where, as I was making it, I was like, "This is going to do well." What's your best advice for someone trying to, to try this and to get into it? I don't want to bring up luck again, but there is that level of like, if you're just shooting something that's really funny, it doesn't have to be this incredibly well shot edited thing. Like, it's just funny, and that's yeah. what's so great about TikTok is it rewards that authenticity. If it's interesting enough where you want to keep watching until you get it, that's mm -hmm. even better. I'm gonna have to like try one of these. Like, I like I don't even know what this is, but hashtag spandex exercise. <laughs> this is up my alley. Your favorite thing, the hip sugar. Come on and shake that cute little booty of yours. But it's funny you picked out that one because there it's like sometimes you just have to make a TikTok oh, that people aren't like. Like, you know exactly what I'm talking about, jazzercise, whatever. Yeah. A lot of people on TikTok probably haven't seen a jazzercise video. I think that I should do the Make a TikTok Every Day Challenge and see if I can I pull would, one off every single day. I would love that. I would support you, and I would also be your advisor. <laughs> and for more tips from Dave and a look into the creative process of a man who literally never runs out of ideas, his brain is always working, watch the full interview. It's up on the Oh My Golf podcast on YouTube or wherever you listen to your favorite shows. And, and Jim, we were just talking about this. He actually, they've grown since this interview. They've yeah. added two more people to their team. They have people doing TikTok and for, for, they, for work, which is do, incredible. And making news cool. Yeah. Yeah. yeah he's which doing is a, hard. Doing a great job every of that. day.